Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. The European Commission unveiled a significant initiative worth $544 million aimed at bolstering artillery production to aid Ukraine in its ongoing conflict with Russian invasion forces. This financial commitment addresses the pressing need for additional ammunition for Ukraine, as certain American Congress members have impeded military aid legislation. Named the Act in Support of Ammunition Production, ASAP, the initiative aims to substantially enhance Europe's artillery production capabilities. The European Commission has set a target to achieve an annual production capacity of 2 million projectiles by the end of 2025, underscoring the urgent need to replenish Ukraine's ammunition reserves amidst obstacles posed by certain Republican legislators in the U.S. ASAP focuses on five key areas of ammunition production, explosives, powder shells, missiles, testing, and reconditioning certification. Financial allocations include approximately $270 million for powder shell production and $135 million for explosives manufacturing. This endeavor is envisaged as a collaborative effort across multiple European countries, with a projected investment of $1.5 billion into the supply chain to expedite production. By January 2024, Europe had already attained a production capacity of 1,155mm shells per year, thanks to prior efforts, indicating the continent's growing ability to support Ukraine's defense needs against the Russian invasion. In comparison, the United States is also expanding its artillery shell production capacity, targeting the ambitious goal of producing 100,155mm artillery shells per month by 2025. This forms part of a major initiative to ramp up production capacity in response to increased demands, particularly in support of Ukraine. Currently, the U.S. Army manufactures 30,155mm rounds per month, up from the pre-conflict output of 14,000 rounds per month. Plans are underway to further enhance this capacity through the construction and commissioning of new production facilities. The European Union's ASAP initiative aims for an annual production capacity of 2 million munitions by the end of 2025, following a substantial investment announced to augment artillery and munitions production in response to Ukraine's urgent needs. The EU's current production capacity, specifically for 155mm shells, had already reached 1 million per year by January 2024, demonstrating a significant commitment to supporting Ukraine's defense efforts against the Russian invasion. The notable difference between the US and the European Union lies in the scale of the planned increase in production capacity and the timeline to achieve these goals. While the US targets a massive monthly capacity of 100,000 shells, the EU is working to double its annual capacity, showcasing different approaches to meet the ammunition demand. In related developments, the Biden administration announced on Wednesday a $300 million military aid package for Ukraine, primarily sourced from current U.S. stockpiles. Moreover, NATO Secretary General Jen Stoltenberg emphasized the importance of increased support for Ukraine from allied nations, urging them to demonstrate political determination and expedite their assistance to meet Ukraine's needs in its struggle against Russian aggression. That's all for now. See you later.